Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. Now, of course, you don't have to, but it would really, really help me out in where I'm trying to get my channel to be. So thank you very much for that. OK, so let's move on. So my clip today is all about American Crew hair products. And we are looking at the Firm Hold Styling Gel and the American Crew Parmade. So these two products here. First things first, if you're wondering, hurry up, hurry up, get on with it. What what are they like? Are they good? They're fantastic. We're going to go into a little bit more detail. OK, so what I want, we're going to start with the styling gel. So what I want from my styling gel is I want it to hold my hair. I want it to give me an immense shine. and I want it to look after my scalp. I don't want it to be itchy, uncomfortable or give me an irritation. I don't want it to dry my hair out. And absolutely, I do not want it to flake or go into bits if it's touched or if you brush your hair or brush past your hair, you know, like with your hand or your jacket, if you go to put your coat on or anything and it starts to go into bits, that's the absolute hate of mine in hair gel. But I have to admit, I do love a good hair gel and the American Crew one, I absolutely love. Now let's start off by price range. Now this is a small one. This is a hundred mils. I actually got this in a gift set, which was given, uh, which was uh, given to me as a gift. Um, but this hair gel, I have done a little bit of research on here, and for 250 mils, the price ranges from around £7.50, and there is as much as around £12 and, any, and anywhere sort of in between. Now, in terms of the hold for this, it does give, I wouldn't say the most super strong hold, but it does give a very firm hold, and it really does just allow you to style your hair. I hate those gels where they've gone too far with the strength, and then you go to style your hair, and it's gone like concrete already. So then what you end up doing is pulling at the hair and of course that that is damaging and it does not do your scalp any good at all this gel smells really, really nice it's a real subtle sort of a nice manly sort of uh, almost like a, a clone smell really really nice it combs sleek through the hair really easily um, if you're anything like me I absolutely love the 1910s 1920s inspired hairstyles so there's real combs sleek back looks like what you can see I've got going on now now would you be shocked if I was to tell you that my hair is as long as my chin so it's really really difficult so I'll just give you a little bit of what's happening at the back. So it's just kinking out at the bottom here. But you know, what? I kind of like that. What I've done is I've brushed everything backwards. And then the small hairs which are here, I've just gelled almost to my face. But as you can see, I've combed them down straight, grabbed the comb, combed the sides back nice and sleek. And then I've just combed everything off to one side. As you can see, everything is combed back nice. And I've got the side pieces here, which I think looks really, really cool. So a 1910s, 19 inspired, 1910s, 1920s inspired hairstyle. Now, I always say with a hair gel, you have to either use a little bit if you've got fine hair or use loads. Now, why would you think I'd say that? So, for example, if you use a little bit and you've got it in dry hair, then it's going to boost that hold, that thickness, that fullness in the hair. If you use sort of too much, but not necessarily enough, what you'll get is a real see-through, less density look. Whereas I like to use absolutely loads, my 1910s, 1920s inspired comb slip back looks, because you get something like this, where it looks right the way down through to the scalp but you have got the hair there. Of course, because naturally in parts of our hair, it's going to be finer. Now, if you're doing a comb sleep back look, then this isn't necessarily a problem because of course I've got a light in front of me and it shines straight through. If you've ever been in front of a spotlight and it shines directly through to your scalp, you'll know that it makes your hair look really, really super thin. But with this, a comb sleep back look just looks really, really cool, really sort of classic and that real nice sophisticated look, whether it be for sort of for work, for business, for meetings, for going out, for dates, that type of thing. Really, really nice sort of on point look. Um, really, really, it is a favourite of mine, actually. My hair is getting almost a little bit long now to sort of do these styles because I don't like this, what comes out. Now, I've sprayed this several times today down with a free spray and it hasn't kept it there. As you can see, it hasn't kept it. <laughs> but it's actually kind of quite nice because the whole of the back sort of kinks up a little bit. Um, but I wouldn't necessarily sort of aim to have that, but particularly if I was wearing this style to work or sort of a business occasion or sort of anything like that at all. Um, I'd want it to be perhaps a little bit cut in. But of course, with hairdressers and things being closed throughout, I think this is our third lockdown here in the UK, I'm unable to do that. But it just goes to show you can still have a really smart professional sleek look with the right products without necessarily having to have so many regular haircuts. OK, so let's tell you a little bit about it on the back here. So anyone who doesn't necessarily know the brand of American Crew, it's a really premium top end sort of product range. Um, and it is a bit of a favourite of mine. And I have to admit, I do always receive it in gifts. Um, and, and it's lovely. The quality is always there. A little bit more costly, but of course you pay for quality as well. And that is certainly what you get with American Crew products. Let's try a little bit on the back. So I told you on the front here, so it's a firm hold styling gel. 
Here we go. And it says here, firm hold, non-flaking gel, which is perfect, of course. And this is a hundred mils because it was part of a gift pack. Um, but high, high hold styling gel with alcohol free formula helps hair look thicker with added shine. Low pH prevents drying out of hair and scalp. So that's great. So I know it's not going to dry my hair out. I know it's going to look after my scalp. And I know it's not going to, because it's telling me here that it's not going to go into flakes or into white bits at all. So that's fantastic. It's also got alcohol free. Now, anything for alcohol in a in a hair product what that can sometimes do is if you're using it every day or over a long period of time it can dry the hair out and dull its natural character and shine so it's great that it's not got that in here as well also there's a low ph prevents drying as well so that's predominantly more for the scalp if you've got a sort of uh if you haven't got that balance there then very often you may find that the product starts to agitate your scalp particularly at the nape of the neck or in the front of the hairline where the hair can be a little bit sensitive in men so that is really great that you haven't got that in here as well. Now, I've worn this all day from very early. I've worked today. I work from home. So I have my hair gelled super, super early this morning. Um, and I have, we are now in sort of early evening around seven o'clock. And I have not got any irritation or anything in my neck or anything like that at all today. So perfect for that. OK, so and just something else I did want to pick up on this is in the ingredients. What I really, really like is it is fruit oils in here. So for example, there is sage leaf extract, there is uh, safflower uh, seed oil in here, and there is ginseng root extract. So you know you've got some real nice sort of natural products in here as well, which is going to be great for looking after the hair and particularly the scalp too. So you can really have confidence that you've got those quality sort of ingredients in this hair gel and that you can have the knowledge that your hair is being looked after while you rock those really, really cool styles. And I don't know about you, but I really, really like this. I mean, this looks a little bit more fine here, but I can assure you there is hair here. If I just put you here, that's sort of my hairline. So as you can see, it's combed back, sleek, and I've got, thankfully, quite a nice, because I use all sort of stimulating products and things, I've got quite a nice, healthy hairline. My hair is, of course, thicker in places than others. But of course, if you're looking after your hair, your scalp, and the right products, there's no reason why you can't enjoy thick hair. But I have to just put that out there as well. If you have got thin hair or thinning hair or like a real widow's peak, a real strong widow's peak here, you can still rock a really cool style. You can still have healthy hair and scalp and hold on to the hair you have got already with good hair care practices. Okay. And of course, thinning hair, thin hair can still look absolutely amazing on a man or a woman. Let's move on. So a pomade. So this is one of my favorites. Now, as you can see, there's a figure on here. And that's Elvis. So very often, pomades can be used for those pompadour style looks. So the side's really super short, then the high volume in the front, lower at the back. Now, have a look at my channel. I have got loads of pompadour videos and clips and things on there, showing you necessarily how I do it, the products I use, and reviewing products best for it too. I will be honest, I don't very often use a pomade for a pompadour style look. And that's just because I find that it doesn't give me that that sort of enough hold because I like my hairstyles to be sort of concrete fixed. I don't like them to sort of have that slight movement. If I'm wearing a style like a pompadour all up here in the front, I like to have that sort of rigidity, that, that structure underneath and that sort of solid foundation. So I've got the confidence that it's going to be fixed in that style all day through. And of course, using the right products, you don't have to worry about your scalp or your hair. If you want to know more, have a look on my channel. But this, in terms of a pompadour, what I would always, um, pomade rather, what I would always use a pomade for is a slick back look. Now, I have got this in today. In fact, I used a little bit of this, and then I used a little bit of this just to hold in and tame the sides down. So the pomade through the top, so it's still got a little bit of, as you can see, it's quite plump sort of move, you can still move a little bit. Um, I was going to say pliable, it's not plasticine, <laughs> um, but it really does work as a, a sort of combo together really, really well. So I use this for my sides to sort of taper it down and a little bit sort of um, up here on the sides of my scalp. Um, pomade through the top works absolutely wonders. Inside, it's got, I don't know if you can, if you can sort of see, you can't really on here, but I still got quite a bit in here as you can see, but it's got a really, really amazing smell. It almost reminds me that it's sort of ever so slight sort of fruit extract, like a little bit of citrus smell. Um, I haven't actually, I haven't actually taken the time to actually look in the ingredients on this one at all. But I wonder if I can just, as you can see, just on the bottom, it's always worth taking the time just to have a look at the ingredients in your product because it's, I don't know about you, but I always like to know what's going on my scalp. Um, where are we? So, 
we have the ingredients here. And just picking it up straight away, we've got the castor oil in here, of course, which we know uh, is really, really great for your scalp, the conditioning of your scalp, and looking after the cuticles of your hair. And there is actually quite a lot of evidence out there said that castor oil can thicken hair. I don't know how true that is, but of course, in a hair product, I wouldn't necessarily think so. But of course, it would really, really look after your hair and your scalp. So we've got that in here as well. We, again, we have got the safflower uh, seed oil. We've also got the sage leaf oil, and we've got the ginseng root extract. Uh, and we have got a couple of other science sort of products in here, but there are a few sort of uh, sort of flower, sort of plants, oils in here, uh, sort of fruit extracts, if you would sort of call it that. Um, so you can really have the knowledge that you've got all those great quality ingredients in your hair product, which is amazing to know, because, of course, then you know that you're looking after your scalp, you're looking after your hair and your overall health of that cycle of the hair to keep it growing thick and full and healthy. Um, one of the one of the things actually which I believe uh, the cause to be thinning hair uh, sometimes in men and women is incorrect and improper hair care and health sort of regimes. So for example in a woman straight off using lots and lots of dry shampoo blocks the follicles can cause a whole host of problems with men not washing the product out and then not taking the time to massage your scalp and really open up those follicles to get rid of that product buildup. Product buildup can be absolutely catastrophically damaging to hair because if you imagine the hair's got to grow through those those uh, follicles which very often could be could have buildups of sort of products in sort of molecules from hair gel free sprays powders texturizing and there's so much out there now you can style your hair with and of course this all takes a toll on your scalp so without doing the correct hair care and sort of health regimes whether you're a man or a woman your hair's going to, in the end, it will start to pay the price. So using good quality hair products and having those good hair care sort of routines in the bathroom is vitally, vitally important. Let's tell you a little bit more about the pomade. So I absolutely love Elvis. I have always loved that sort of era of the hairstyles and things. Loved his music. Still love his music. Uh, hairstyles, absolutely, really super cool, super awesome. If I could have been in that era, I absolutely would. So when I seen this in the gift pack, which I received before, absolutely amazing. Um, I really, really like this pomade. As I say, it's got a really nice fragrance. It has got a nice hold. It reminds me of sort of like the texture of honey, you know, thick honey, set honey. That's what it reminds me of. And it looks a little bit like that as well. It goes through the hair like a dream and then take a comb and then like what I've done, comb through the top nice and neat and sleek. And then you can enjoy a strong hold but of course not a cement sort of hold if you wanted to you could still sort of move it around a halfway through the day if you want to have a little bit of water i imagine um really nicely it's an all-round great sort of uh duo of products here which really i absolutely love using and you know what they wash out really nice they don't dry the hair out um you have to be a little bit careful with the pomade i always find that i need to use a second shampoo but that doesn't dry my hair out at all just because i find the oils in the pomade and um, my hair's fine so if i was to wear my hair natural the following day and pass a straightener through it i may then pick up a little bit of product so it does sort of stay around a little bit so i always think that a second shampoo is great anyway for hair care products because once you're washing the product and the oils of the day will build up off your hair and then you're getting those ingredients which is in your shampoo on the scalp and get them working and get those follicles open and allow things to breathe and cleanse. Okay, so I don't think we've missed anything on here. So it's an 85 gram pomade. The price of this one, you can get this uh, huddle up online from around seven pounds all the way up to 15. Um, so it is a little bit more of a higher price sort of product, but of course it is premium and you pay for quality, don't you, after all? Um, and with this, I think you just, you have that heritage um, behind American crew products too. And I absolutely love buying into heritage in a product too. And that sort of whole history behind it, which is really, really cool. I will just tell you a little bit on the back here what it says so it's a water-based formula rinses clean offers smooth control with shine works well for curly hair as you can see i don't have curly hair but i imagine that would work really well as well um work a small amount evenly through dry or toweled uh, or towel dried hair and style as usual so for me i always find exactly like that towel dried hair i've used it several times on dry hair but i always find that you get a much more better effect if the hair's damp so i would absolutely recommend your hair being damp and then you can really enjoy a nice polished sleek finish like this to your style and same for the gel as well always have a little bit of damp sort of moisture throughout the hair because it just helps get that gel through but of course with the gel if you wanted to use a little bit through damp hair and then grab a blow dryer and then really get that lift and that control in the hair there's no reason then why once you've done that you could take a little bit of the pomade small amount through your hands and then pull your hair off to the side or throughout the back and then you get a really nice high volume sort of shine look 
Okay, so I really hope you've enjoyed my clip. I certainly have. I love American Crew. I absolutely love this sort of gift uh, sort of set. It came with a wooden comb as well. Unfortunately, I've misplaced the wooden comb for today's clip, um, but it is a really nice set and the quality is great. I have used the shampoo actually from the range. The, I think it's uh, the stimulating uh, shampoo. Unfortunately, I haven't got that anymore. It will be something I would use in the future, um, but that is, again, a really good product. In fact, I don't think I've actually had a bad experience with American Crew products. They are really top quality. They are a, a more of a premium price, but of course, like we've said, you pay for that heritage, that history, and of course, that quality. Thank you very much for your company. As always, it's an absolute pleasure. Thank you very much for your views. And if you do have any comments or questions, please leave them down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can. So until next time, thanks very much for watching and we will see you then. Bye bye now.